Tesla's Gigafactory starts battery production, Asian Snapchat clone growing like cray cray, and Mark Zuckerberg's 2017 personal challenge. It's Wednesday, January 4th, and this is Crunch Report. Welcome to the Crunch Report. It's a beautiful overcast Wednesday here in Las Vegas, Nevada, where CES 2017 starts tomorrow right behind me. See it over there? Booths are getting set up, stages are being built, and we're hoping to cover it all. Let's jump into that sweet tech news. Tesla's giant factory in Nevada, the Gigafactory, has started producing lithium ion battery cells in mass capacity with the aim of supplying products including the upcoming Model 3 electric vehicle and the Powerwall 2 home energy supply unit. So much power. While the Gigafactory is operational, it is far from complete. The design Tesla used allows it to open different phases for business as construction finishes on each, which is what will help them use to build production batteries now, but also scale to much greater production capacity over time. Tesla says it aims to have capacity ramped to the point where its production of lithium ion cells tops 35 gigawatt hours a year, which is almost at the current electric battery production capacity of all the world's suppliers combined. The Asian Snapchat clone Snow that caught the attention of Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg, who tried unsuccessfully to buy it last year, has some growing numbers to share. The app's Korean parent neighbor today confirmed it crossed 100 million downloads in December, with 40 to 50% of its user base active on the app each month. China is the largest market in terms of users, with Japan and Korea following respectively, although the company did not disclose raw figures for each user base in these countries. So lesson learned here, if it walks like a Snapchat, if it talks like a Snapchat, and if it's cloned for other markets and countries, Snapchat, prepare to get an offer from Mark Zuckerberg to buy it. Now word from our sponsor. The all new Prius Prime Electric Hybrid is more than Toyota's most advanced Prius. With purposeful design, intelligent ecotech, and breakthrough efficiency, it's the new possible. Speaking of Mark Zuckerberg, before I was interrupted by that ad, MZ every year sets himself a challenge at the beginning of the year to complete, and this year is to travel to every state in the US. In a Facebook post he wrote, my personal challenge for 2017 is to have visited and met people in every state in the US by the end of the year. After a tumultuous last year, my hope for this challenge is to get out and talk to more people about how they're living, working, and thinking about the future. Past challenges have been building a personal AI, running 365 miles, and reading 25 books. Have fun on the adventures, Mark. Seems fun. That's the report for today. I'm Tito Hamzy. Crunch Report airs every weekday at 7 p.m. Eastern, 4 p.m. Pacific on techcrunch.com. You can also find us on iTunes and on YouTube. And we'll see you tomorrow for the first day of CS 2017. The sun is coming out. The sun is